Greetings everyone, welcome back. So last time we beat the boss in this area. And um, yeah, this is the way I need to go. This time we'll actually explore a bit further and we'll go into content that I've not seen yet because this is where the demo stopped. So I am quite keen to see what's next. Guessing it's this way. This is where we use the key. Crotch City Hall courtyard key. Hmm. To view the guide again, menu settings guide. <gasps> here it is. The Nini works. Everything you see here belongs to the Nini. The classiest playboy and most brilliant inventor in Krat. Just ask him. Not just puppets. Almost every machine and tram in Krat is supplied from here. You gotta be curious about the guy. What kind of person is he? Uh, I wish we could find him. That is, if he's still kicking. By the mir miracle medicine here. Miracle alchemist Clark Shaw, also known as Dr. Cure All, has succeeded in making a cure for the horrible plague that has spread through Krat. Made from unicorn horn, blood of a two headed snake, <laughs> and boiled down metric, Clark Shaw has tested it himself and confirmed that it is completely that it completely cures the plague. The blue plague is not a divine curse. Don't be afraid anymore. Come see Dr. Cure All, Clark Shaw. Prices may vary as it is a limited item. Yeah, I, uh... Unicorn horn would be a limited item, wouldn't it? Very limited. Non-existent, even. So, yeah, I am glad to see that immediately the, um... Kind of the environment is changing up a bit. Because that was kind of my fear when I played the demo. Everything looked good, but at some point... It kind of looked a bit... a bit samey. But yeah, this is clearly... They're changing it up. What are you... Is that a gun? No. I'm gonna jump you. Okay, that looks bad. You also have one. I could take him down in two hits. Awesome. Check your corners, people. Hmm. I'm gonna go for it. Something I desperately need, but oh well. No way. Oh, not a bad choice coming down here. What is that on your back, sir? Hmm. 
Well, a lady puppet, I should say. Let's try to use this. Oh, nope. Oh, crap. Okay, so you don't use it the entire time. He's one of those gentlemen that stays there. <laughs> yeah, you're kind of in an in-between place. You're kind of like, oh, I should be going back, but I doesn't know whether to follow or leave. Man, I am not. Good thing I upgraded my health so much. There you go. What do you have? Star fragment. Alright. Well, that's all of our cells gone. You are very annoying. How can I... How can I... Can I even get... Maybe... Ooh, look at that. Yep, should have gone here. Pay back! <laughs> it was actually... I saw that piece of wood and I thought, this doesn't look too sturdy. And it wasn't. Hmm. Maybe I should put that on a, uh, a quick slot somewhere. Or I could put it here. Uh, that one. There you go. Special, special resistance. I don't know what that is actually. A special ampoule made to enhance a puppet's special resistances. When used, it enhances resistance to shock, break, and disruption. A robust defense position is sometimes better than attacking. The resistance ampoule was developed to raise a puppet's tolerance to abnormal statuses. Wait, this this is the one that cures. I want to put that one actually on my uh, on my bar. There we go. Alright. This time, hopefully, you won't be so lucky. Hmm. Alright. Yeah. Someone mentioned on um, one of those videos on, uh, on my uh, videos I recorded of the demo. Someone mentioned that they they thought the game didn't well. It, they didn't really mention that the game looked bad, but it didn't look next gen. But that's kind of true because this is also being released on the last gen consoles. But still, though, I don't think it looks. Uh, I think it looks fine. I like the aesthetic. You can always debate about graphic fidelity, but... You are Krotz tomorrow. kind of don't know. I don't want to put myself out in the open like that. That looks like a puppet factory, maybe. Oh yeah, it might... Union works? Ah, another one. Ok, 
Okay, so I could have jumped down here. Emergency protection. Where do I want to go? Oh. Yeah, I'll be with you in a moment. That looks... Yeah. Alright, 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 alright. Uh, oh. Another fine day in the city of Krog. But I wonder, my friend, just where you've been? Oh. <laughs> Congratulations! You've been selected from this cast of... A little... For an exclusive, obtrusive, intrusive... Transmittal. For me, Arlequino. Trinity key. But you do actually need that to uh... A key obtained from the King of Riddle's quiz. This key probably unlocks something. The sacred triangle was some organization's secrets mark. Rumor has it that this organization was Kra True Master. Alright. Interesting, maybe. Oh boy, nope. Oh crap, it was a trap. Forgetting that my R2 doesn't really have that much reach. I really be sticking to my R1 for reach. What do we have here? See, I gotta remember that that is actually pronounced as Venini. Wanting to say Venigni. Yeah. 
Legion magazine? I wonder if we'll go down there. So this is um, where puppets are made, if I remember correctly. So uh, we might be in for some uh, trouble. There's a stargazer. safe let's go down here Yep, I have enough to level up, so I'll be back in a moment. I'll use my power to help you. Shall we get? Uh, capacity is getting a bit low. Maybe I'll get this up to 14 now. It should probably be my capacity is getting rather high. I'm hearing stuff. What does this say? Electric blitz is effective for subduing puppets. Get a what? Get out of here, not a stalker. It's a chain. Throwing objects. Chain that can be swung powerfully, inflicts strike damage on anyone in the area, and spins around enemies that it hits. Sometimes simple is most effective. A quote from a stalker. So we can only use it once, that's a bit of a shame. I think I want to open this up actually, but I'm wondering if we could. We don't need to, really. Uh, let's see. Yeah. I was afraid of that. That puppet was quite, uh,. He's not going to do a special attack. Oh. Throw it this time.
Maybe let's get that item up there first. Back to where we killed the big guy. Anything in here? Anything good? Okay. I'll be back, I'll be back, I'll be back. Hang on, hang on. Check this place out first. I went through all this trouble to clear the way. It might just be a dead end, but. Radiant Ergo. Oh. Oh. Yep, you're an enemy. chest. Alright, I'll go the other way first, and then we'll go. All the whiffs. Okay, we'll be able to get out. We need to use that key for this. No, we just... <laughs> or do that. Salamander dagger blade, salamander dagger handle. Hmm. Let's have a look. Can I wear that without going over? Nope, I'm slightly heavy now. Let's try it. Yeah, that's quick. But it scales off of all the wrong stuff, sadly. Yep. So this one would be... I think this one would be better against humans. Humans, because it does fire damage. I think fire damage is better against human targets, and the uh, electric electricity damage is more useful against puppets. So sadly, we'll not be using that. Um, yeah, I think overall damage goes down quite a bit. Um, also it's not upgraded so that, that that's something so i'm wondering what would happen if i would put that blade on my handle because then i would have a very small blade on a very heavy handle kind of curious oh uh, oh hang on there we go can i no i cannot put my weapon away All right, well, let's check. Does that big guy come back? Just for a laugh, let's see. Assemble weapons through Eug Eugenie at the hotel or at the Stargazer in different areas. Separate your weapon into a blade and handle and assemble them into new weapons that match your character's battle style. A weapon feature are decided by the handle and the blade combo. 
So... What I could do, if, if I ever get a motiv motivity crank, I could up, I could change the scaling of this uh, handle to work with motivity. That might be interesting. Let's do this, just, just for fun. Oh, no, it doesn't. Uh, weapon assemble. The item is already on another weapon. Do you wish to assemble them? Sure, I'll put them back together. Very slow attacks with a very big old slow attacks with a very short weapon. That is, uh, that's a um, challenge run right there. Uh, weapon assembled. There we go. Okay, did the big guy come back? something ago which I might actually just use uh, I might spend some of those crystals hang on I'll be back so let's get this up to 14 there we go which makes me wonder could I now use that without going over uh, oh the weapon is no longer assembled all right all right, nope, I cannot um, wear two weapons yet. Oh, something I noticed that I forgot to mention. Actually, the, the guide on the right that shows you shows you the shortcuts to your buttons, that one, that has disappeared. So it did that on its own. Oh, this place gives me the creeps. It's like something's gonna jump out any second. It's okay, pal. Gemini's looking out for you. Yeah. Oh, so we end up here anyway. Alright, sir, you come over here, please. What do you have there? Okay, just a big pipe. I see you over there. It's so slow that they might just confuse you as much. Okay, so do what do we have here? Wipe, tighten, and grease. A shock cartridge. Mine are clear. Why? Safe here. I think so. so I think that that actually is this one. So everything goes up. So we may as well wear it. Will we go overweight though? I don't think so. 55? No, it did not say slightly heavy. Good. 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 Mm hmm. Is your head on backwards? Manager report. Dear Mr. Vanini, 
As per your order, I conducted a quality investigation on the ergo supplied by the alchemists. Of course, it was done secretly. Certainly the quality of ergo was getting worse over time. Hmm? I do not doubt the alchemists, but the decrease in quality is too widespread to call it a coincidence. At this rate, this quarter's puppets will have a high chance of defects. The most important thing is the quality of the ergo, after all. According to a reliable source, the high-level alchemists are running ergo production experiments lately using another method. Personally, I think their secret experiments have something to do with the decrease in ergo quality. Are they wringing out the bodies of discarded puppets in the barren swamps or something? Anyway, I recommend approaching them carefully instead of complaining to them. Manager Factory 1, Nicola. So, are we... Um so that might be why we're going to the swamps then. Or well, we might end up in the swamps. Let's use another. There we go. Move a bit up here. Where did I crash through? So that might be where. Yeah, yeah. You lost it. Down you go. Oh, nice. Uh, we could upgrade our sword. I'm kind of wondering if I should. I'm always. It's always. You might run into a better weapon. fall down or jump down on me. No. Whoa. That looks rough. Always check. Oh, and we didn't see what happened. Okay. Just trying to read a poster. Question is, do we want to follow? <laughs> Can I go around? I think we have to. Oh boy. to fight you. Well, yes we do. We're committed now. Nope. What you doing?
Okay, you do not like electricity. Stamina back. Mm -hmm. Yes. device developed to raise the hardiness and density of legion arms let me check that again my palms are actually sweaty uh, correction device used to modify the legion arm found only at the workshop legion arm can be modified to with the vanigny craft machine the workshop's correction device developed to raise the hardiness and defense of the legion arm delicate devices like these require consistent maintenance we can carry 99 of those. And I am... Um, pretty much out of everything. So we could... Use the... Uh, maybe we have to? Oh, no. Oh, there we go. could use the medallion to get out of here. I need to remember... Oh! Where is it? <gasps> Motivity crank. Interesting. So the thing is, I could use the motivity crank to crank up the damage of my current weapon, or use it on that uh, dagger handle, because it might be nice to have a dagger. Yes, Stargazer. We can go that way, we can go that way, that way. Actually, that might lead where we've been. Nice. Is this where the giant was? No, it doesn't really look like it. Anyway, I'll, um... Hang on. I'll actually go back to the hotel to see what, um... What we can do with the Legion arm. With that... Now lying. Hello. 
you. You're going to the factory to save Mr. Venini, right? He's the richest man in Krat. A little eccentric, maybe, but a good person. I heard he went to shut the factory down. Hmm. I hope he's safe. I wouldn't want to lose my best customer. Hmm. I know my way around a weapon. Want me to look at something? Alter handle, assemble weapons, talk about training, about Vanini, about something else. Hmm. Mr. Vanini is the richest man in Krat. His company manufactures most of Krat's exports. He's a uh, peculiar, but a good hearted man. Even though he's rich, he treats every employee with respect. I heard he went to shut the factory down. I hope he's safe. I wouldn't want to lose my best customer. Mm -hmm. uh, I guess we have to... Um... So yeah, if I... So this would up the damage by seven if I were to use this. Um, oh, that's interesting. Well, huh. Yeah. So it's not exactly as I thought. It's not, you're not going to turn a, a technique weapon into a motivity weapon. Completely. Which makes sense, I suppose. Huh. Bit of, yeah. Bit of a shame, but uh, otherwise... W w guess it makes sense. Then weapons would be... Uh, you could basically use any weapon with any stat. Uh, assemble weapons? No. Let's have a look at the machine. Moving while charging, leak is current. Continuous small sparks from the hand inflict damage while charging. Increase the maximum level of charge. Press and hold the Legion Arm button to track an enemy. Enables dodging after a hit. If you pull a wire trace, or if you pull a wire trace an enemy and press and hold the Legion Arm button, it will trigger a link attack. This legion arm cannot be modified. All right. So I'm guessing that we could upgrade this one, but I don't see how. Maybe we need another item to do that. Okay. Well, then I'll just level up, and then we'll call the episode. I'll use my power to help you. Thank you. I think we'll go, uh, how much, yeah, I want to get some stamina. How much more do I need? Oh, leveling up is coming, becoming quite expensive, actually. Well, not enough to level up once again. Right. And with that, I'll call the episode. So, uh, yeah, thank you for watching next time we'll continue on but for now farewell <laughs>